in order for you to say that God give it to me his hand is supposed to do it but for the hand of God to do it and to show up in your life your horn has to grow Same. child of God are your horns growing are your horns growing when a person's horns are cut off what are some of the dreams they get when a person's horns are cut off and their hands are cut off in the spiritual realm and all this cutting off is not about physical hands you have hands already but in the spiritual realm what shows up in a person's life let me tell you something about david and Goliath. david okay my brother come you you you'll you be Goliath. Goliath had a sword someone say a sword a sword pastardo is david and david had a stone face him so David has a stone. This is Goliath. And, in, and, and David being a man of revelation, because mind you, the book of Psalms was written by David. And David, the one who said, God, exalt my horn like that of the unicorn. So he was spiritual. He knew. So he knew that in order for me to take something from a person's hand, I'm supposed to crush their horn. So where is the horn located? On the forehead. So he picked a stone and gauges the forehead of Goliath. So the moment he drew the stone, on the forehead of Goliath, who Goliath's horns were broken. When his horns were broken, he fell down. Now look at it. When Goliath fell down, so be behave as if you are trained, but don't throw. Yeah, and fall down. Yeah. Go. When the horns were cut off, because when your hands are your horns are cut off, your hands are cut off. The sword Goliath was having. It fell down and David went to pick it. So if another person easily takes what is yours, they have cut off your hands. First Samuel 17 verse 48. Let's go. Look at it. And it came to pass when the Philistine arose and came drew near to David and David hasted and ran toward the army to meet Philip the Philistine. And David put his hand in the bag and took turns a stone and slung it and smote the Philistine in his forehead. And the stone sank into his forehead and he fell upon the face of the earth so david prevailed over the philistine with a sling and a stone and smote the philistine and slew him but there was no sword in the hand of david david ran come david ran because the horn has been cut off his hands are no more there so what belongs to goliath was already dormant so if your things are dormant it means your horns are cut off so now He's lying down there. So David went and took it. And that was it. So if people are not supposed to take what is yours from you, your horns are supposed to be intact for your hands to be intact.